Hey everyone, it's Lenny and welcome back to the channel. So I hope you guys did enjoy the start of the video. Um, it's pretty much summed up in that start how I think of this glitch, but honestly it's very overpowered and we have seen the result in that by getting a few people getting RP wiped. I have been wiped on one account. I have got the message on another account, but nothing has happened. I will show that footage for you guys to see. Um, completely random with what they're doing with this glitch and like the way they've gone about it is completely random like with a glitch it's patched and they get then they do their business I don't understand what's their thought process because the glitch is still working and they're wiping their RP wiping everyone's RP um, you'll see in a second here this next bit of footage is of the account that I got the highest rank I get the message to say I've been wiped it's been adjusted but when I go online it's not so I don't understand I don't understand what that is all about but what do you expect with E&E? &E? Um, the game is beautiful, it's, it's, the graphics are awesome, but it's very glitchy, very weird, with, especially with this, so I don't quite understand what the goes with this, but um, anyway. If you're going to do the glitch again, okay, if you've been deranked to 120, honestly, it's not worth it. As I've always said to you, the highest level you need to be is 115, I mean 135, sorry. You unlock everything, which is the last armor. 120, you get all the weapons. It's not worth going risking your account again. Now I did say when I first made a video on this glitch that I would suggest to do it on a new account or on an account you don't care about. Um, I've made lots of accounts. I've only been RP affected on one of them. Okay, obviously the second one was, it says it's affected but it's not, so I don't understand. But um, yeah, I wouldn't suggest to do the glitch again. Okay, if you are going to do the glitch, there's a little tip that I have seen from one of my subscribers, I will leave a in the pinned comment of this video, I'll find out who it was and I'll thank you in the pinned comment, so I do appreciate your comments. Get a grenade, um, compact EMP launcher, get on your motorcycle and just stop him that way. Shoot him twice like I did. And then when, by the time you get in the car and kick him out, the car starts back up and you can drive over him and do the RP. You don't use, need to use your MOC. This glitch, this way to do it, is by far the best way I have seen to do it yet. So I do appreciate your comment, bud. Um, I will leave. Yeah, I'll try and find it and leave it in the comment, just thanking you. So yeah, the glitch still works. It's working fine. I just did it, literally just did it before I recorded this video. Um, take advantage if you want, make a new account, get amongst it. If you have two PlayStation 5s, two PS4s, two Xbox Series Xs or whatever, you can do this with your other account that has the mission already, like the phone hits already out. You guys can just do it uh, for your friends as well. Obviously, this glitch you can do it with a friend. Just the person who is going to be getting the RP needs to be the person that hops in the car and knocks the dude out. So yeah, you can do this with friends, and you can do it AFK. Um, above there will be a link to a video that's the AFK version. At the start of the video, there will be a link to the whole glitch. Um, yeah, we're just a glitch on how to get it to happen and whatnot. But yeah, use the motorcycle trick, it works the best. Um, you can use the MOC, but yeah, obviously with chasing the dude, it can be a bit monotonous, as you've seen at the start of the video. Now, I do hope you enjoyed the video, guys. Definitely appreciate you all, and I will catch you in the next video.